Hi guys, so here we are. This is Silly Simon. So I'm just going to do like quick comparisons and reviews of the new iPhone 4 S. That's the iPhone 4. And I'm going to show you the iPhone 4 S in just a second. I have it hidden in this super secret, sexy, awesome blossom covers just so it doesn't get scratched. And those were in my pocket. Anyway, so here we go. Um, you guys all know iPhone 4, how it looks, what it does. It's pretty awesome blossom. And yeah, it's the usual awesomeness. This is. So now let's look at the iPhone 4S's. So I keep the iPhone 4S's in the secret super awesome protective cases. Uh, I'm just going to put on my gloves so I don't want to get this all gross. I want to make sure that everything is awesome blossom and perfect. So, without further ado, here is the iPhone 4S. Da, da, na, 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 na. Super awesome! And you can see that it looks exactly the same. Oh my gosh, no way. So, let's check out what they did. From what you can see on the surfaces, it looks exactly the same as the last iPhone 4. But, some things have changed on the inside. It's like they just picked up the jock strap and they were like, oh my gosh, peek booze, let's change some stuff inside of here. So let me just get that out of the way. Uh, they just basically took the CPUs, made it into the dual core A5 processors, which basically resulted in some more awesome blossom processing speeds, uh, better cameras. Now it's 8 megapixel and records in 1080p's. Lots of P's. Uh, what else did they do? Oh yeah, and now they have this new super awesome Siri. So now when I say something like... Set a meeting. I'm Awesome Blossom. No it won't do that. In you still recording me? Using iPhone voice control. You can tell iPhone okay, iPhone yeah, so I'm gonna stop that. Uh, so basically, yeah. That's about it, really. It's not that they made a lot of different changes on the outsides. A lot of people were expecting that, but it turned out to be that they just changed the insides. Um, is it really worth the money? I don't know. It's because it's a slight improvement. Yeah, it's a little bit faster. Uh, it's a bit stronger performance in that sense, but is it really worth shelling out that much money? I don't know. Because it's a lot of money. Anyways, so... Personally, I might be switching over to some Blackberries because I was actually waiting to see what iPhone came out with. But for now, I guess the iPhone 4 is okay. Unless I can get a deal on the Blackberries. Anyways, thanks a lot for watching, guys. Um, and I guess I'll see you guys later. I'm going to be reviewing the Blackberry Torch 9810s versus the... Sorry, 9860s. I'm so silly. 9860s versus the iPhone 4 very soon. So tune in for that. And this has been Silly Simon. Toodles my noodles.